Good morning! Slept in again. It's great. Sleeping in is so good. Oh god. Yes, I think this is the last day I actually get to sleep in because tomorrow's really when Gen Con really kind of starts for me. So, I guess I should have slept in a little longer. Um, all my friends are on their way. Looks like they're, are, they're just gradually arriving from like 1 onwards. It's 10 right now or something. I'm going to get dressed. I'm going to put on some face and then I am going to go to Hot Topic and pick up a birthday present from my friend Desmond. It uh, He's he's a volunteer for Gen Con but he's also a really close friend and it's his birthday yesterday and a lot of us are gonna go hang out at the Tilt Arcade and or Glow Golf which are right beside each other to celebrate his birthday and I want to get him a little present. I think I'm gonna go to Hot Topic and see if I can pick him up like an Overwatch shirt or something like that. We will see. Bye. We are going to see Bee Coffee Roasters because I don't think I've shown you Bee Coffee Roasters yet on this trip. It is a uh, coffee place that is right across from the convention center on Georgia Street pretty much, just right around the corner from them. And they make really cool coffees and they usually try and do something cool for Gen Con. <laughs> Look at it. Look at that. It tastes really good. I got the honey and lavender one, which is super cool. And as you can see, this is the convention center. And right behind me right there is where Bee, uh, Bee Coffee Roasters is. So they are super close, super convenient. We'll have super long lines, but their coffee is delicious. And it's not just straight up Starbucks, which I also love, but it's just something a little different. So. I highly recommend them. Their coffee is super nice. I'm in the mall and currently the goal is just to like look around until I find something. So come with me. that I was looking for an Overwatch shirt for Desmond whilst wearing my D.Va shirt <laughs> and whilst also being decked out in a D.Va hoodie at the same time. Some may say I have a problem. has been acquired and I got myself one too because I don't have any self-control and um, again Osmo is out so it's a little shaky right now Derek just messaged me and told me that the indie, indie souvenir store here in the mall is selling bootleg Gen Con merch which is hilarious so I'm gonna go check it out maybe I'll buy something What's happening right now is that I am aimlessly wandering around. I know my friends, two of them have arrived in Indy and neither of them has messaged me. So Matt and Swada, I'm calling you guys out. Come hang out with me. I'm just aimlessly wandering around Indy by myself. Also right before coming to Gen Con, I bought these new shoes, the Kangaroos. And uh, they have been pressing on my feet a little bit because they were brand new out of the box. They arrived the day we were leaving uh, for Indy and they've been kind of pushing my feet and causing some discomfort and I'm happy to report that they are now broken in and super comfortable. I was really worried that I was just gonna have to like deal with pain all con because the only other pair of shoes I brought is a very thin soled like a cute shoe as opposed to like a 
gonna walk around the con all day shoe so yes these are my con shoes comfy cushioned cheap they were precisely $25 on payless.com so these guys are plastered on every single door of the convention center and since Gen Con is sold out I guess they're really gonna enforce the whole your badge must be visible at all time rule and because we don't have because Gen Con doesn't have the space for extra people this year so uh, maybe it's to prevent ghosting which means people showing up without a badge and still going in I guess this year and it's probably gonna be really difficult to show up without a badge and kind of Gifts. It's homemade? Yeah, it's from a, a festival. It's handmade or hand sewn. It's a fluffy uh, whale. The card is uh, custom made from Manitoba, too. That is so cute. The company is called FLF. Yep, I think she has an Etsy shop. I'm not sure. Thank you. It's a unicorn pinata. What are these? They are cinnamon, like mini cinnamon rolls. Oh, and yours are, actually has pecans. Yes, in it. and this is the mini pecan roll. Mm. And they came from Taylor Bakery in Allisonville. Do you remember Mr. Wider? Mr. Wider. I'm here. I now have a friend. Oh. I did say I had a Matt earlier, but Matt disappeared to go to CVS. No, you check I, out your hair. Oh, yes. Okay. Oh, my God. It's very, it's very much 20. I can take the thing out. Hold on. Like, it's okay. Like, hey, you have priorities. I do. I mean, my food, right? <laughs> Hydra, <laughs> that's your real name. <laughs> Friends are here. Oh, Eric, Hi. Melissa, Sueta. We're here to celebrate Desmond's birthday. <laughs> Jump up. Yeah, we got a cake and everything. It's in here. Yeah, cake time. Options, sir. The tilt for air hockey and laser tag. Uh, glow in the dark mini golf. Laser maze. Fun racing tournaments available. There is a laser maze in there. It is hard. What, what's hard? Like what is? Oh, it's like for the mini golf? No, no, no. It's got lasers, and you gotta get through to the other side like, without touching the laser. Yeah, it's hard. Oh, ooh, that sounds pretty cool. But I want to do something that everyone can do, and we're we're kind of. I'm oh, well, it's like two minutes long. Oh, it is? It's short? Yeah. The what happens is, if you get through? Huh? What happens if you get through? Uh, you get through. Congratulations. Oh. <laughs> um, why don't we see how much the golf costs and how much the laser tag costs? Okay, let's find out. Yeah. You ready to be James Bond? Yeah, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna happen. Let's do it. Oh, oh my God. Wow, that does kind of quick, surprisingly. <laughs> Is this the easier one? Yes. <laughs> you can do it, Desmondino! You can do it. Oh, 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 oh,
not yet. Oh, keep going, keep going, jump! You got a penalty of time, but you can still... How many times does that much time exceed? I don't know. I think it's based, they just time you the quickest one wins. You can do it, come on. Flip! Flip. If he flips, I'll be like... Ah! Brace your Bruce Lee. Yeah, you can do a little more flexibility with your feet that way. Yay! Nice job! Whoop, 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 you did it! Oh, no. <laughs> Play go golf and uh, go glow golf, and I'm 100% certain that he kicked all our butts and that he won over everybody else there. I had <laughs> most of, most of the like rounds that I had it was like eight eight shots or something. It was bad, but we had a lot of fun, and he also killed it at the laser maze. And right now, Derek and all the volunteers, including Desmond and Tuwada and all them, are at their uh, all hands meeting where they all get their missions and instructions and stuff um, Matt and Stuart uh, and my group have arrived already and they are <laughs> Matt's room got double charged so he is figuring out a thing with the hotel and then they want to go for food at the Ram but I already went to the Ram yesterday and I don't really want to go again and I already ate so right now I'm just going to go back to the hotel room and maybe start editing this video as I said it's 8 we'll see the night is young no plans right now Friends are meeting in the convention center to have Desmond's cake. Look who I found. What's your name? Jim. Jim. And why are you at Gen Con? And what do you love about Gen Con? I love the people. I love the atmosphere. The hotel is fantastic. It, do you it, always stay here? No, this is the first year we've stayed okay. here. I uh, usually stay at the Marriott, but uh, the renovations and everything. Plus, I didn't right. get the points for it either. So. Yeah. Are so. you in a train car? No, we are not. So unfortunately, we got five people, so we're in one of the rooms. It is a little small, but we'll make it do. What's your, what are you most looking forward to doing this year? Uh, well, we don't have the t-shirts right now, but Starfinder. Oh, nice. Are you going to play? Are you going to demo? Uh, we're going to do the demo, and then we're going to try and play. We're going to get the books, everything. Everything. So. You're really excited? Yeah. Me too. I yeah, can't wait to play We just it. went over to Scotty's and got the uh, t-shirts. Mm. They yeah. have a lot of Paizo writers here this year, too. Oh, okay. Working in the Paizo booth in the... Exhibitor Hall. They only bring their own staff, so some of those people are writers. My friend Logan writes for them, so oh, okay. you can even get him to sign it or something. I, I, that's what we're hoping for. We're trying to get the books, and maybe we can get some of the yeah, authors. Yeah, they to actually sign like it. work the booth a lot of the time. The authors and stuff too. Okay. So you might be able to do that. Very cool. All right. Cool. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I absolutely love meeting you guys. You have no idea when like you guys are like, are you Nelly? Like. It tickles, like I just presume that hardly anybody watches my channel. Like I really, I really do these videos because one, when I was first coming to Gen Con from Ireland, I know nobody and knew nobody that had ever gone before and I couldn't really find any good YouTube resources, which is where I do a lot of my research. Um, so I wanted to do a vlog like the one I was looking for when I was first, uh, you know, uh, just, I was just looking for somebody's experiences of Gen Con. And so I'm making the types of vlog I was looking for. And second of all, I do these uh, almost like I don't really buy any souvenirs. I don't really buy things like trinkets, but I vlog this like a personal diary so that I, I can go back and review this. So the fact that people are watching this and it's helping people and they're enjoying it is just something that I never expected. And it means a lot to me. So if you see me at the con and recognize me, not at all like expecting that that's gonna happen but if it does please don't be afraid to say hi to me I would love to say hi to you so I'm just waiting right now and Derek has a special event meeting in the in the door there with his like 
I don't know, 30 something volunteers maybe. There's probably a little more than that, but I'm just patiently waiting for cake. The mirror inception. We said happy birthday to Desmond. We sang a song. We had some cake. God, I'm really bad at vlogging today. I just didn't catch any of that. But I'm gonna go try and see who's left. <laughs> Where do you travel from? St. Louis. I have the Area. power of editing. <laughs> He's part of my regular Gen Con crew. He's a very good person. He does good cosplay. <laughs> you will see on Saturday. He will be Star Lord. Come say hi. Sorry, spoilers. <laughs> Heather's part of my crew She's also. So Where did you travel from? Michigan. How are you liking uh, One Deck Dungeon? It's fun. I'm not good at this game, but it's fun. Kick Nobody's good at this game. Oh. This game is hard. Okay, which one do we want to put the black sex on? They're Just really the loving five. it. Don't listen to yeah, them. Yeah, one of the fives is great. I don't know. I've got a blue... I had a really good time seeing everyone. I got a delivery of Carcassonne Winter Edition. Um, this is really what Gen Con is about for me. Is It's not really... It's really about the atmosphere and the people and the friends I make and the people I meet every year. It's not quite as much about the events and the variety of things that go on here, though that it does play a really bad part, a really big part. I'm not sure if it would quite work if it was all of the same people at like Origins or a PAX. I think this convention has the perfect like balance of excitement things to do um like i don't want to say like that it's exclusive at all but it's definitely like the one thing that me and all my friends look forward to all year and we spend this isn't just a four-day event that we go to this is definitely an event that we've all been looking forward to since last gen con we've all been planning it for all year we've all been saving for it we've been talking to each other about it constantly on like group conversations and then when we finally get here it's just like we've never been like separated for the year even though like there's people coming from Australia Canada Europe I just it's just really great it makes me feel really loved this convention is definitely like home for me I said like a lot <laughs>